Hello. In this video, I will be demonstrating how to install a splice-on connector on the KF4A Active Clad Fusion Splicer. First, turn your machine on. At this point, install your back boot onto your fiber. Next, your heat shrink tube. Place your fiber in the corresponding holder, leaving a one inch tail. Turn your automatic thermal stripper on. Open your automatic thermal stripper. Insert your holder. Close your doors. At this point, it has stripped off all of the outer coating, including the acolyte. Clean. Place in your cleaver. Close your trash bin receptacle door and cleave. Insert into your splicer. For your connector, use the corresponding connector holder Open your door, place your connector inside of the holder, close your door. Place inside your stripper, close your doors. Again, left door first, remove your holder, clean. Place inside your cleaver, close your door, cleave. Place into your splicer. Close your wind cover. At this point, it will begin an alignment. Pause is allowing you to make adjustments if needed. Once you're ready to arc, Press play. Once complete, open your wind cover. Allow to perform a tensile test. It's a two Newton pull force across the fiber. Pull and hold. That pressure is sitting on here until you release by opening the doors. Open both your doors. Remove your connector, allow to hang. Bring up your heat shrink to the base of your connector. Open your oven. Place the connector inside the oven. Turn on the oven. This process takes approximately 30 seconds. When complete, Open your oven, remove your connector, place inside your cooling tray. Allow to cool for 10 seconds. Once cooled, bring your back boot up and assemble it onto your connector. Place your top shell. Your connector is complete. This completes this video.